How's everybody doing? Welcome back to my channel. This week it is the grand finale of Tattoo Warriors and only one artist will be taking the title of Tattoo Warriors. So with that being said, let's get this day started. Let's go! We saw all the stencils, we saw all the concepts, and I just want to say that I'm proud of you guys. You know, you guys are amazing artists, and <laughs> I couldn't be happier, man. Like, you guys are getting so much love on social media because you guys are producing some amazing tattoos, and I just want to wish you guys best of luck today and kill it, you know? Yeah, you guys are pushing the bounds, man. Like, this is difficult. This is super difficult, and after last week, I'm curious about today. Today is today's gonna be insane. Well, I'm excited. I'm really genuinely excited. I, yeah. Everyone here is so good. I wanna see everyone just shine. I wanna see maximum effort. The challenge for today is gonna be whatever placement you guys wanna do. So you guys can produce the best tattoo out of this whole competition. One is gonna get eliminated uh, and it's gonna lose the chance to win the Tattoo Warrior title. We're gonna have a third place as well. That's gonna be gaining $200 worth of tattoo supplies. Second place is going to get an armrest with additional uh, supplies. And first place is getting $5,000. And this beautiful trophy that I have behind me. Let me, let me pull it out, man. Let's... Oh, it's heavy. You guys can't touch it until the end of today. Last week, we asked uh, all your people to drop a comment on YouTube to support you. And whoever got the most comments was gonna get an additional 30 minutes. We went through 800 comments this morning. So much love, so much love. And the person who's getting the additional 30 minutes is Joseph. So with that being said, let's get this day started. Let's go! <laughs> Uh, so first of all, I want to say thank you guys for making it here to the grand finale of Tattoo Warriors. We already walked around. We saw some crazy ass stencils. Um, I was looking at Joseph. I don't know, man. I think that's a little big. Dude, I think that's a I know. little big. Be between Roger and Joseph, they got the biggest pieces they this week. Pieces. So I'm pretty sure Roger can get it done. Mm -hmm. I know Joseph, he's been accomplishing some, some crazy pieces. This one's the biggest so far. Well, since you're a color artist, what do you feel about Big C's? Do you feel like it's gonna create contrast or? Oh, for sure, yeah. And especially the darks next to those lights, and those neon colors are gonna pop like crazy. I'm a little nervous about Thomas though. Yeah. Um, everybody's pieces fit the area. Thomas, it just looks a little small yeah. for the area. You I, know, I, I'm I kinda, curious what he's gonna do to close up that, that area. I kinda wanna suggest for him to go bigger. I, I want to see kinda, it bigger too. So I, I think I'm going to approach him and just be like, yo, I think you should go bigger. Because it does look like a little sticker. Yeah. I th and I think, what, I think the reason why he went that size, it is because it's his comfort zone. Because he, he's a slow tattooer, so he knows he can finish that size. But if we can just like push him a little bit. Yeah. Big C! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How are we feeling today? Good, we made actually. it to the last week. Yeah, I'm pretty excited to be here, honestly. Good, good. What are we working on today? <laughs> I'm working on like a, some like, kind of like a neon realism piece. Oh, shit. So yeah, it's a, there's a lot of color. Uh, so there's a bunch of neon lights, reflections, yeah. on the glasses. Uh, so how are we feeling about securing that title of Tattoo Warriors? How are we going to get there? How are we going to do that today? Um, I am just going to stay focused, you know, um, try to stay on time, you know, because yeah. that's a lot of work to get done. And then last week you were in the bottom too. Mm -hmm. How are we feeling today about that? Are we going to bring in our extra 125% A game over here? Yeah, I'm bringing 150%. You that's know, what, that's I'm, I'm what I want to hear. Thank Good luck you. to you, Big C. You, yep, thank you. I'm actually super happy to even be here. 
being at the bottom last week. So, you know, I'm really pushing myself to go for that win this week. How are we so, feeling today? Feeling good, feeling good. Oh, okay, Ari, so what are we working on? So today we got like a medieval kind of design, old creepy castle, and okay. kind of like a demon girl protecting a little castle, you know? Okay. I know that you had started a little bit with the hiccup this morning. We had a bit of a switch up on your stencils. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do we feel about that? Yeah, well, it was just like a, a size difference is what it was, you know? Okay. And. Uh, to kind of wow the judges and wow myself, the whole design. I decided to why not just blast it right over his whole outside calf, you know? So. Okay. Now, now let's be honest, walking. were you trying to play it a little safe? I could probably say that, yeah, hell yeah. You know, <laughs> uh, time is not going to be my friend today, so you know. I think they're definitely wanting to see your full potential today, and I think we're definitely going to be able to see that today. Yeah, man, if I get this done, man, I'm going to... I'm going to be really happy with myself, I'm be happy with the design, and hopefully the judges think the same. Yeah, we know you could finish it. We're excited to see what you got. For All sure. right, Thomas, good luck. Thank you. Because I made it to the finale, like, I expect myself, and I got a lot of people behind me expecting me to win it, so that's the plan for today. Man, I just got to, I just got to zoom in into this yeah, little man. guy right here. Man. <laughs> That's tight. I think anything that brings the community together, you know, especially the artists. Like, this is not only bringing people from, from Phoenix, but it's bringing people from Atlanta and, and California, too. So um, some of the judges have came as far as, what, Florida? I think it's amazing. We need to have more stuff like this in, in our industry, you know. It's a lot of like-minded people in, in one roof. So it's been a great experience. Joseph, <laughs> what up? how are we feeling today? How are you doing? I'm doing all right. All right. I see this huge piece today. You are probably one of the only artists doing this big of a piece. How are we going to get this done today? Um, Ten hours. Yeah, just fucking no breaks probably uh -huh. and hard work. Have you, <laughs> <laughs> have you done a piece like this before with this time frame? I've done style mashups before um, okay. and I've done pretty big tattoos pretty quickly just because okay. uh, clients like getting their stuff done. But how are we feeling with the support? Oh, I feel great. Oh, I feel good. super good. I mean, uh, everyone back home is rooting for me. Uh, my wife will be here today, so that will really help. Oh, that's uh, awesome. So I see that you're pushing it today. Is that because you were at the bottom two last week? Dang, you got me in the soul right now. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, yeah, I mean, nah, it's more so like, this is a competition, mm -hmm. it's Tattoo Warriors, and I feel like the first two tattoos that I did, I like really, really pushed myself. I do a lot of the same types of themes, and um, I just wanted to go outside the box. Well, we're excited to see what you got. We're definitely hopeful, and we know that you're going to be able to finish this. Thank you. Good luck. Yeah. Good luck, Kim. <laughs> Feels really good to make it to the grand finale. Honestly, like even last week when we were in the semifinals, I really hadn't like processed it yet, so like I didn't even like I wasn't even thinking like semifinals, next one's grand finale. It's just like now we're here and it's like okay, this is the last one. Roger, my man. All right, how are we feeling today? Um, as usual, nervous, anxious. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. what are we working on today? Let us know. Uh, we have a cyborg type geisha going on here some okay. peony flowers just going as big as i possibly can like everyone else you know it's the last day so yeah uh we gonna go big or go home <laughs> One or the other. very different from your first two pieces so we're really excited to see what you got yeah and then you did win best of day last week how we feeling again about that uh that just made me even more nervous it's like, what's the chances I win three in a row? Oh, damn. The, the, the most important win. And I did hear that your family came with you this weekend. How are we feeling about that? Yeah, uh, I'm excited to see them in here later. Uh -huh. They don't really get to see me tattoo. I like to keep uh, working families separated. Yeah. So it will, it'll be fun to see them. I think this might be my 
my youngest son's first time really getting to see me tattoo. Oh, I'm um, sure that's going to be a great experience for him yeah. to be able to see his dad do do what his dad does best. Yeah. <laughs> Make it to the grand finale makes me feel really good. You know, I have a lot of doubts, so just being rewarded and winning best tattoo of the day two times in a row is uh, it's really nice. It is making me very anxious though, because now my odds are quite slim. Uh, the odds of winning three times in a row are it, it, whoo, real tight. So I'm here and I'm ready to do it. Who's your favorite right now? Wow. <laughs> you know what? I ain't gonna lie, man. I was I was a little nervous for him, but I'm not nervous anymore. Joseph. He seems like he's the slowest moving one uh -huh. when he comes to hand motion, but man, he's moving. He packed. He's plucky. Wick. How about you, Umberto? Yeah, yeah. They're all moving decently fast. I would say I was pretty shocked. I, was, I didn't think they were gonna get that much done as what I'm looking at right now. Yeah. Um, but from when it comes. I don't know, something just keeps looking at uh, Thomas's. I think it's just the smoothness of it, that bright pop in the bottom. I love the, 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 the contrast in it, so that's what really keeps, but I don't want to judge too soon just because he's the one at that pop right now. Yes. And Roger, what Roger's doing, dude, the, the amount of flow that he has in it, the way yeah. he designed that whole sleeve. Yeah, dude, that's he a has the flow. Too. Big C, uh, I don't, something about Big C is that the last two hours, the whole piece changes so yeah, from that beginning yeah, yeah so you don't yeah. know what he what he's gonna do until like 7 p.m tonight mm -hmm. the whole day is like black and nothing else mm -hmm. but then the last two hours it's like oh shit where the fuck did this shit come from <laughs> she's asleep for yeah she's sleeping dog I guess she's, she's asleep. wow i gave her some of that numbing spray <laughs> you know what i mean like she went to bed I just love that he's been able to showcase all the different types of style that um, he specializes in. Um, I just think it's amazing that he's able to just do what he does best. No matter what happens, in the end of the day, you're still a winner and we love you. So uh, how are you feeling about the tattoo so far? I think it's looking really, really good. Pain-wise, how are you feeling there? Um, we're hit and miss in some spots. Behind the knee is really bad. What's your favorite part of the piece? Honestly, it's gonna be this face, but I really like how these, you know, <laughs> those little abstract swirls come in. It's really yeah. Cool. I learned how to pretty much be humble. You know what I mean? It's a humbling moment being around talented artists like this, and uh, I learned a lot, you know, about composition and the way tattoos flow and trying new things to push my own boundaries on the way I tattoo every day. Speaking for Thomas's perspective, like just every week, like him coming home and wanting to really push himself, really focusing, like just all of the energy of this whole competition. You know, you guys have put on a really good competition. No drama, everyone's been really hospitable and um, yeah, it's been really cool. I love you and you got this. You are fully capable. Um, I know you can do it. How are you feeling, Thomas? I'm good, bro. I'm fucking locked in, you know? Crank it through it right now, for sure. Yeah, man, so... Came in with like a strategy to be done with certain section in a certain amount of hours. Go on to the next session, be done with that part there in a certain amount of hours, you know? Just gotta have some kind of game plan coming into this shit, so... Um, but honestly, man, I'm excited. I think it's gonna... If it's executed right, Shit, I think it's gonna be. It's looking crazy so top. far, and you already know I trust you with this nah, for, for sure. sure. It's a pretty big piece, and it's gonna look good. And I'm, I know I could kill it. It's just a matter of time. Will I, will I be able to finish in time? That's really what it is right now. Rocha is uh, taking a nap. 
<laughs> yeah, he's stressed. <laughs> Big C stepping it up. Yes. Big time. He's yes. like stepping it up like crazy right now. And then you got Joseph. I can't see Joseph right now because mm -hmm. he has all that plastic all over the yeah, place because yeah. this client is hurting. Yeah. So I, I'm like, I, I need to see it. I mm -hmm. want to see it just to get some idea of how he's doing. Mm -hmm. But the client is not doing so good. Yeah. Big C's client is doing not so good either. Mm -hmm. And then that's what happens when you yeah. plan and, and you really try to figure out what you got to execute mm -hmm. because it's like a ticking time bomb. The yes. bomb when it explodes, that's the, the client tapping out. Mm -hmm. So you got to figure out what areas you know you can get out yeah. of the way fastest. And then, you know what I'm saying? Once it comes to those little areas, you know, so that you just need to finalize, then numb it, mm -hmm. and then finalize those details. Yeah. Oh! There it is. He's ready to oh, go. Oh, wait it. a minute. Yeah, yeah. Zoom in. Can you zoom in? <laughs> there it Juicy. is. Juicy. Oh, my God. Juicy. You want to split? Oh, dude, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll force it. It was that good. Seriously. I already put your card in my back pocket. I was like, the next event we do, I got to get them out there, bro. Seriously. Yo, Choose yo. one. I'll get this one. Mm. Yeah, you already know why. Mm. <laughs> you said, really? Oh, come on, man. Here we are, Minji's Backyard Barbecue. We got ourselves uh, pulled pork sandwiches today. Chicken with that Alabama barbecue white sauce. Shoo. Very juicy, by the way. Mm, well very. seasoned all mm -hmm. the way through and through with our own homemade aioli. And of course, we got some jalapeno cheddar sausage that takes a three day process. Ooh. Three days. So, <laughs> and of course, most requested here is our homemade banana pudding. You know, I, I, I live with him and so to, to watch him go into creative mode and be like, all right, well, how am I gonna outdo myself next week? Or how am I gonna just break out of whatever shell I'm in right now? Um, so being able to watch his creative mind like really start to explode or get curious about like what else can I do? Um, it's, it's been really awesome watching him in these last couple of weeks. Joseph, I'm really proud of you. I'm really glad that you were able to do this. Um, been holding it down at home with the pups and the cat. Um, you have a whole army behind you. It's not just me. You have all of Tulare, you have all of family, you have all my family. So I'm really proud of you and I hope to see you win. Feeling my man? Oh, like fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like though. I mean, I bet it looks badass, but goddamn. <laughs> that shit hurts, bro. I really hate you. <laughs> the good thing is you only got two thighs. True shit. The other one's gonna stay blank. <laughs> <laughs> this is an important day, and I did basically everything I could to make sure that I was ready and set myself up for success rather than failure. You know, I made it a priority one, made sleep a priority two, um, made sure I touched base with like people that like, you know, I, I love to feed off of my family. Got to have dinner with my mom, you know, yesterday was my, me and my wife's one year anniversary. So it was just like, just trying to, to hit all the, the stops and, and not do too much and just mainly prepare for this. We are so proud of you. Continue to be our hero and we love you and we think everything you do is awesome. <laughs> How you feeling? Ooh, not the best position I've ever been in. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what color are we doing in the hand? Uh, purple. Nice. So just something to compliment these uh, yellows that we have. I, I don't want there to be any debate about who did the best tattoo today. You know, if I. I want to win and know that I earned that win. I don't want to win and doubt whether or not I deserved it. Quick announcement, quick announcement. Can you, everybody hear me? We got two hours left, two hours. Two hours, but for Joseph, two hours and a half. And I don't want to start any drama. Keep killing it, my dudes. Keep killing it. <laughs>
Uh, I would say that win or lose, I am happy with what I put out and I, I put my best work forward and you know win or lose, you know, I'm just gonna do my best and I'm going for the win, so let's get it. We're getting there, I'm just starting to like layer in these lighter colors. I mean, this is when it's all gonna start to come together right now. Are you gonna do white on the on the glasses? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do heavy white. Damn. Starting to layer these babies in, and then these glasses, I want them to like shine. That you is You know what I mean? Be crazy. super fucking bright. I, I when I first saw the, the the design this morning, it looked intimidating to me. It's intimidating it's to me too. <laughs> <laughs> me too. You know no, that's why yeah. I'm doing it. You know that's no, why I'm doing it. It's intimidating for sure, just because. The way I see it, I'm super used to high contrast, mm -hmm. so I know how to work it. Yeah. But in this case, you got high contrast, but also saturation throughout. Yes. So that's what terrified me when yeah. I looked at this in the morning. But now that I'm seeing it here, I see that you're adjusting. Well, keep killing it, bro. Thank you, man. Big C! Got this, man. Everything that you've done in your career prior to this moment right now has led you to this point. We love you, and just do your best, brother. Grateful, man. I know I pro it probably was a whole lot. It was a whole lot, man. This was a four week journey. Um, it's kind of been a roller coaster, you know what I mean? Excited to be here week one, week two, stressed out, week three, getting back in the zone, and now week four, back on stress because of it's the finale. So um, I would just like to say, you know, damn, man, I made it and I'm happy that I am here. Uh, just enjoy the journey, man, you know? I guess I was uh, so tuned into my head, you know, but now that I'm here, it's just like a matter of enjoying the whole journey. How you feeling? Good, bro. Just trying to get out of this fucking corner here. I feel like it's a little time consuming. I know it's like the little detail shit. So like, yeah. it's a little time consuming, but if I get out of this within like the hour, I can spend the rest of the time getting the face done, which is a little bit more. So your game plan is to knock that out first? The plan is to get this whole section done first, and yeah. then uh, once that happens, I would like to think that this is already smeared away. So I'm gonna, I'm obviously gonna recensor this whole section. Yeah. But I need a good cutoff section to mm -hmm. do that. So. I like how you're approaching it, especially doing the gray wash first and saving the color for last. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kind of have a nice little pop in there. Yeah. Yeah, we're all I'm excited to see it done, man. Yeah, man. Me too. Shit. We're all gonna be surprised. Oh yeah. <laughs> I just love creativity, I love ideas, especially cool ass ideas, you know what I mean? Like especially for what I'm seeing right now, like what they chose to, to, to work on and display, you know, obviously they're gonna choose what their strengths are and uh, should be like their maximum potential, you know, like everything you got type of deal. So I'm excited to see the results. Honestly, you can tell the progression each week that they're trying to push themselves further and further. The tattoos are definitely a lot bigger today than they were on week two. They're way bigger, they're massive. And to try to complete that all, is still in the same amount of time, is incredible. It speaks to these guys' skill. And I totally understand why they kept moving in on the competition. So what's up, man? How you doing today? I'm good, can't complain, how about you? Pretty good, man. Yeah? So uh, I got some questions for you, man. Yeah. Your background, what do you have, what do you have planned for that right there? Uh, we're just gonna do some traditional black and gray in the background. Oh, some, some black and gray, can mix it up a little bit. Yep, not gonna overcomplicate it. Make sure, uh, you know, traditional Japanese, they always got black and gray background, color mm. foreground, makes it pop. Oh no, for sure, for sure. So what's the motivation for the, the subject matter on this one? So uh, this entire time, I've just let my clients, as usual, tell me what they want. Oh yeah, yeah. so it's his idea? Yeah, his oh, idea. Okay. Yeah, I was coming out badass, man. Appreciate it, thank yeah. you. Uh, I would just like to tell my family, friends, the audience, everyone who supported me, thank you. Uh, you know, I've been very anxious with this whole experience and lots of doubts creeping in. And just the fact that I've had so many people believe in me is the only reason I feel like I can do this. So it's greatly appreciated.
How you feeling? I'm chilling, bro. So honestly, bro, today I think is the the first day that I can say that I'm enjoying being here all day. Because the first three weeks they were stressful to produce everything. Yeah. So today I'm I'm enjoying myself, but sadly you guys are not enjoying yourself today. <laughs> <laughs> nah, we're having fun. That's Homeboy's good. not though. Yeah. You got this. You got this. You got the extra 30 minutes, you know, so that you got the you got that advantage right there for sure. Dude, I'm so stoked on that. Damn. It's gonna help a lot. Yeah, that was a lot of people that dropped your name on the comment section. That should It all cool. like hit like all at once. It seemed like Yeah, it all hit all at once, but also I don't at the beginning of the, the video when it dropped, you were already getting comments. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. So it wasn't like randomly. Uh it was throughout the two days oh, of just yeah. dropping your name. I got all the homies here at the house. Hell My wife's yeah. here, so that's that amazing. Makes a, a big difference. Today's a good day for you. Yeah. Shit. Sure, well, keep killing it, my guy. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, everyone was was really like ecstatic. They were they were super stoked for me. It was like almost like if I won already, you know, like everything. Everybody was saying such positive things, and it's exciting. I'm like, dude, no matter what happens right now, like I'm good. Like I'm gonna go home, and I'm just gonna get to work. I don't want to get too corny, but you know, you could do anything. I didn't say anything the other weeks, but a couple days ago would have been my one year anniversary. And it, it's uh, one month after my anniversary of like not being on chemo. So, ugh. you know, I had cancer. I went through the whole process, lost my hair, lost weight, gained weight, sat through like five days a week for like four months, which is like a small stretch compared to other people, but. That shit took me to a place I never, I never thought I would go to. And um, a year later, right here, you know. So don't take your opportunities for granted. You know, do everything as good as you possibly can because you never know. You only get one crack at it. Got to make it count. Another update. Now we have one hour left. For Joseph, an hour and a half. Boo! Alright guys, one hour, kill that shit. All right, we're done. Hell yeah, that was great. We are done. My guy, appreciate, appreciate you, bro. you, brother. Thank Always. you for inviting me. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate it's been you, an experience, bro. to say the least. Yeah, man, this one's a one for the books, bro. Fuck yeah. All right, my man. Oh, my God. It's been a long day. Uh, I think I'm in love with you, dude. Appreciate you for sitting through that. Knuckle me, bro. Yeah. Woo! Woo! It's a big tattoo. It sure feels like it. <laughs> long session everyone finished right on time it was an insane day watching everybody work putting out some crazy tattoos was just very inspiring and motivating but now it's time to start judging the tattoos and figure out who's gonna take the title of tattoo warrior I just want to say that uh, today was amazing to watch you guys do some amazing tattoos no one can deny that you guys are insanely talented artists uh, I feel like social media really loves everyone that's here and I think that's my favorite part, the fact that we were able to put you guys in on a platform. You guys are definitely standing out and exposing it to everybody to really admire, you know, what you guys are doing today. So uh, I just want to, you know, round of applause for you guys. You guys deserve it. Yeah, you guys are amazing. Um, you guys showed up, um, showed out and yeah, you guys brought some heat for sure. Yeah, this this is the most tattooing I've seen in, in, in a single session from you guys. So yeah, congratulations. You guys you guys killed it. I was stressing the whole time, like, damn, who's gonna like I, are you the one that making the decision, right? Like that's just <laughs> cool, you know, and then the clients as well sitting through all that, you know, like man, that's off to you guys too for sitting so still and letting, you know, the artists do their thing and shit and really, you know, show off and stuff. So we're gonna begin the judging now. Uh, let's get right into it.
you know, Joseph, come up. It's huge. It's huge. <laughs> but that's my torso. Right <laughs> <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> <laughs> scene is settled now yeah. uh, after uh, like 30 minutes or so mm -hmm. that colors are really popping a lot more too Definitely. i like the bold uh color choice you went with you know what i mean so mm -hmm. yeah it's the, a lot of the flow lines that you have on that too also go really good with the leg yeah. Come up, Roger. The line work, it never misses. Like, it's, it's amazing. I was curious to see what colors we're gonna use as well, especially the background. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really nice and soft. Hello, good one. Thank you. Come up, Thomas. Yeah, that's solid, man. Yeah. What a good choice solid. to go I bigger. Like the eyes, I really yeah. like the eyes. Yeah. And I'm glad you got to finish. I was when when you went bigger, it looks amazing. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. All the tattoos are insanely good, so it's gonna be very tough. Obviously, as you guys know, it is it is not easy. It is not easy to pick between you guys, you know. And I'm glad that uh, we decided to give you another chance to be here in, in the finale, because that's what we wanted to see, you know. Like we wanted to be conflicted and confused about you know who's gonna take it. Congratulations, you know. Congratulations, guys. You guys are winners already. <laughs> my top, my top two, at the moment, is Thomas and Roger. Man. Thomas for sure. Uh -huh. Roger. So Thomas Roger. and Roger. I was honestly thinking maybe be, uh, Big C. I was waiting and seeing how he was gonna, you know, uh, just apply the color and stuff. You know what I mean? Because he did show some really, really nice colors. I was really excited to see the results and stuff. And then when I seen it, I was kind of looking at it. I was like, ah. Oh not saturated enough for me i see skin pigment still it's like uh so to me personally i liked it i, I love the design and stuff i just wish it was more saturated and it had that pop you know i feel like it was missing something joseph um i was a little just a little bummed out like mm -hmm. i wanted to see more contrast mm -hmm. you know between the dragon and and the samurai uh it's still an amazing tattoo yeah and, and uh, i believe it's gonna heal out amazing and it's gonna look very mystical has a, it's gonna have a lot of atmosphere yeah. and and it can be connected later with it, that it, same thing it can mm -hmm. me and the judges had a really tough conversation and we had to go back and forth about who was gonna take fourth place and who was gonna take first place but we came to a decision and now it's time to let everybody know uh this has been an amazing journey uh for me uh i, I think it's something new you know and I'm very thankful that you guys made the effort to come here every weekend and compete. And I also want to thank the judges as well because I feel like we needed people like them to really help me out and decide who's gonna take the title. You know, and also a special thanks to the team, uh, my wife, you know, Marcos, the innovative team for always, you know, having my back as well. You know, and being my first time doing something like this, it's. It's very rewarding. I feel grateful and blessed uh, for this experience, you know. So we're gonna, yeah, congratulations, guys. Congratulations. Yeah.
<sighs> Let's get started. That's you. Oh, God. That's you. So, first place to design and to execute. I have like this eye just to, you know, I, I try to find as much as I can. I, I focus on saturation and line work and, you know, and, and, and the most that I could just pay attention throughout the whole process of what makes it pop and what makes it, you know, stand out from normal things that you normally see, right? <laughs> uh, I think we agreed. And uh, to go with Joseph. Yeah, so that leaves me um, third place. You know, this 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 has been tough this entire time. You know, and, and like, how do you pick this piece from that piece? You know, and there's there's certain elements here, there's certain elements there that I, I just love about everybody's pieces. Contrast. I want to be able to read the piece across the room. I don't want it to get lost and. Third place. Uh, big C. That leaves us with the top two artists who are gonna be fighting for the title of Tattoo Warriors and the $5,000. Uh, I need Roger and Thomas to step up. <laughs> Overall, you guys are amazing. Uh, you've been on the top every week. You had one week where it was very questionable, but you, you bounce back and show everybody that you got this shit, you know, and uh, you deserve the, to be here. Um, and between you guys, it was very tough, different styles, but the execution was flawless. And uh, give me a minute, give me a minute, guys, got this, this is hard, I'm sorry. <sighs> so, um, Daniel, Humberto, and myself, uh, after looking at both designs, uh, looking over every single little thing you guys did, from the flow, to the application, to line work, saturation, uh, and how creative did you guys get with this? We decided that in second place, goes to Roger. Wow. Great time, too. And in first place, <laughs> for the title of Tattoo Warriors and $5,000 prize goes to Thomas. Kevin and your whole team here at Innovative Inc, man, you guys have like made it really welcoming here. Uh, thank you to all the judges that have been here. I want to thank my wife, Antoinette, here. <laughs> my baby, Rome. <laughs> you know, she uh, keeps on, she keeps inspiring me, man, you know. Uh, I wouldn't be shit without her, so. <laughs>
Oh, yeah, bro. Congratulations, bro. Thank you, man. On behalf of Higher Level, here's your reward, bro. Congratulations, man. Appreciate it. Thank oh, yeah. you. Thank you, man. Yeah. You get your yes, prize, man. On behalf of Higher Level Tattoo Supply, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> What's up, my man? How you doing, bro? Hey, hey. Congratulations, man. Thank you. On behalf of Higher Level for winning first place, you got your new self. Oh, new machine, bro. Man. All gold, too. Come bro. on, man. All gold. Thank you, man. Thank you, bro. I appreciate yeah. you. Congratulations again. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much for tuning in every week to watch this show. I really appreciate you. And I just want to thank you for supporting my vision. It is something different and it is something new for me. And I just want to thank everyone that was a part of this show. And I am just thankful that I met so many amazing people. And if you're an artist watching this thinking, man, I wish I would have joined this competition. Don't worry, because I'm officially announcing Tattoo Warrior Season 2. I don't know the exact dates yet, but it will be happening later this year. So if you're a tattoo artist, I hope you learned something from this video. And if you're a tattoo enthusiast, I hope you're going to entertain. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.